Hello guys, on this channel we have a new tradition of challenges, which happens every week or every few weeks. And today I have a new challenge for you. So challenge for those of you who haven't seen previous challenges is a task that I give for you in the form of GitHub repository, which you need to solve the challenge and make a pull request. It usually takes up to one hour. I'm trying to give smaller challenges. And then I have a separate video, I shoot a separate video discussing the results, discussing your solutions. So topic of the day is many to many relationships with pivot table with extra fields. And the challenge is that you have a form, I have a repository which is prepared for that, for Olympic medals. So Olympics have just passed and we can try to mimic that Olympics by doing like sports and then who won the medals, which country. So you choose one country, choose Algeria, for example, whatever, Belarus, it's all countries of the world seated. And then so you fill it all and you click submit. And then you have the result table of gold, silver, bronze, as usual in the Olympics, ordered by most amount of gold medals. And if it's equal, then it's silver. If it's equal, then it's bronze. So ordered by one of those three, one by one. And as I said, I've prepared a GitHub repo for this with help of my colleague Narius, who will actually participate in reviewing this time. So Challenge Many to Many Olympics is a public repository and the link will be in the description below as well. And what you need to do is implement that thing. So all that thing that I've just shown is just a mockup. Well, mockup in Laravel, so countries are seated and it is in the form of this controller. So sports controller has three methods, create method to get all sports and all countries to populate this form and the create blade actually exists. So create blade for each of the sports, which is five sports seated. And then for each of the sport, three drop downs first, second and third place. But the submit for the form, so for example, submit route store. And if we go to the routes, there's homepage for the form, post for the sports, which is store and then store redirects to show, which is the table and store and show methods are empty. As you can see, it's hard coded in the show, sports show, it's just hard coded table. Let me show you sports show, it's all hard coded. So your task is change that to be not hard coded. So to do that, you need to create a relationship between sport and country model. A hint, it should be a many to many relationship, but I intentionally don't give any clear directions because it's like a task from the client. I need you to create this table from this form and that's it. That's all the developer knows. How to implement that, that's your choice. And also I would give you bonus points, although it's not a competition, if you implement front-end validation as well. So currently in those basketball, for example, you can choose the same country twice. If you have more time and if you want to try to implement that validation as well, both front-end and back-end, I would gladly review your code and use whatever you want for that. You can use plain JavaScript, Vue.js, jQuery, Livewire, Inertia, whatever. That's your choice. I will try to review any of that code. And speaking of reviews, when you do a pull request to that challenge, so your task is actually explained in the repository. If you don't know how to do pull requests, I have a video with instructions linked here. And depending on how many pull requests I get this time for previous challenges, it was from 100 to 40 on other challenge. We'll see. Maybe we'll have time to review all of the requests. Maybe it will be like 10 or 20 randomly. But as I said, my colleague Nerys will help me with that. And another important thing, don't rush, don't hurry. There's time. I will give you two or three days. So today is Friday. So I will make reviews probably on Monday after the weekend. So you have full Friday, depending on your time zone and full weekend. So I won't review the first pull requests. I will review random pull requests. So there's no competition on time. Take your time. I hope it's a task that can be accomplished within an hour, but actually let me know how much time it took you in your pull request comments. Just out of curiosity, maybe there will be some average here and Good luck. And I hope after your pull request, I will have a separate video with talking more about pivot tables, many to many relationships and how to calculate some stuff from them. So subscribe to the channel to get all the updates on that and see you guys in other videos.